You may not know it, but Israel is home to over 135,000 Ethiopian Jews. And just a year ago, yet another group of Ethiopian immigrants made their way into Israel. But there's still a lot to be done when it comes to promoting the Ethiopian inclusion into the Jewish community. And joining us to discuss this very issue is Shmuel Legasa, an Ethiopian-Israeli international community activist and educator. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you so much. So, Shmuel, I gave a, a couple of you know quick facts about the Ethiopian Jewish community, but can you tell us a little bit more about its presence here in Israel? Yes, uh, Ethiopian Jewish community, uh, it's over, I can say, over 35,000 in Israel, and we, our young generation is fast, it's growing and growing, and uh, also there are a lot of Jewish yet to come mm -hmm. uh, back to in Ethiopia. And, uh, Absolutely. and uh, I, our Ethiopian Jewish has long historical roots to our Jewish identity and uh, comparing many Jewish all over the world. And we have the similar history, but our is very old and very old and... Uh, and not many people know about this existing Ethiopian Jewish community either, you know, from abroad. We know Israelis living here that, you know, there are over 135,000 Ethiopian Jews living here. We see Ethiopian Jews on the street, but the rest of the world is not so aware of this community. Um, but, you know, there are still a lot of steps that need to be taken in terms of integrating the Ethiopian Jewish community into Israeli society. Would you say uh, that the Ethiopian community is properly integrated right now? Yes, there is a problem integration. Any new community comes in any kind of country, and uh, especially when is, there is no much of lifestyle and there is a difficulty. Also, uh, in addition to that, we have, you know, some kind of racial discrimination. Mm -hmm. That's fact and real. And but at the same time, uh, we can't deny there is a lot of good steps are taken. Right. And but the world and the international community need to know that Israel is not some kind of a white nation that other people think no. Israel is inclusion of many kind of peoples like me, like you, like any other one. And due to that fact, Israel is a land for black and white and all people. And well, that's also why, you know, you see so many activists who are freely speaking up about ongoing discrimination that exists here against the Ethiopian community, police violence. Like you said, there is racism just like in any country. Yeah, even in America, right. even in America right. until now. Well, what is I'm, being done to address this? What I, uh, I myself personally, I am not satisfied with the action if that is taken. For example, uh, Bibi Netanyahu, our uh, Rosh Mamshala, our president, our prime minister, they organized a new uh, va'ad or com committee mm -hmm. that will deal with this uh, situation. Right. And the committee even did a special investigation about the issue and they come up with 50 or 70 points, but the action still need to be taken more the inclusion in education, professional integration, and we Ethiopian Jews, we are a social capital for the state of Israel. Absolutely. We could have you come in and talk about this for ages. Unfortunately, we've run out of time, but we would love to have you come back into the studio to talk more about this issue in the future. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.